Was I just robbed? <laughs> My entire drawer system and it's gone. Just a casual robbery in the Tetons. That sucks. <laughs> that sucks. That sucks. Hi guys. Coffee at night, it's my new favorite thing. I went to Walmart this morning to replace most of the stuff that was stolen from me. <laughs> to be honest with you guys, I can't remember what was stolen from me. Like I can't remember what was in that drawer. I remember a few things, but blue. No, eating rocks. And you wonder why you have flat teeth, child. I can't remember everything that was stolen. So I think it's gonna be one of those things that I'm just gonna have to replace it as I go and as I remember. And like I go to reach for something and it's not there and I'm like, oh, add it to the list to repurchase. So I'll show you what I did get though. Luckily for me, they had the exact same drawer that I used before, so that's nice. It's all like brand new and spiffy. The other one was like cracking in the corners and stuff. So I mean, I guess it's not that bad. But I replaced it. My pan was stolen, so I upgraded to a cast iron, and this thing is heavy, okay? I don't know what I was expecting, but I was not expecting like a 20 pound pan. But I did want to upgrade to one eventually, so. I guess when your original pan gets stolen, it's kind of the time to upgrade everything, right? So, we've got a pan. I picked up a couple more camper meals just to have more butane. I can't remember if this was in that drawer that was stolen or not, so I just picked up another one. It might be around here somewhere, honestly, I haven't looked. Protein bars I picked up. I got uh, plastic silverware. That's fun. More PB2 for my oatmeal. I got so much oatmeal. <laughs> Three packs. I went a little overboard, but I just wanted to make sure that I had some, so. Don't worry guys, oatmeal was secured. In several different flavors too. I picked up a multi-spice thing because all of my spices are gone. I can't even remember what I had in there. I picked up more aluminum foil. That was in my drawer. Camping soap, although I heard that you can't use soap on a cast iron, is that true? So, actually, I don't know why I just picked, I guess I'll use this on my utensils. Um, cooking spray. And then I picked up soups. Because I had soup stolen from me as well. It's kind of, I just got the basics to get me through the next, you know, couple days to be able to cook and stuff like that. And then, as I go, I'll just replace everything as it's needed because... Like I said, I, I honestly, I can't remember. Oh, I have a rogue protein bar over here. I also need to get organizers, but the ones that I had gotten before I got from Target, so I only went to a Wally World today. I need to get organizers so everything's not in just like one clustered mess in there. I'm gonna write down a couple things while I'm thinking about it. I know I still need to get a can opener cutting boards. I had those ones that folded, which were so nice because you could just like throw it right in the pan without it spilling everywhere. My little scrubby brush to clean. That was in there. Oh my gosh. I had so much in there. I just forgot. 
like I said, I think certain spices and things like that, I'll just wait until I need them and then I'll go repurchase some then. Knives. I have some knives from that grilling kit that I got in my P.O. box, but I had other ones in there, so I need to replace those. Anyways, that's just off the top of my head that I can remember, so. Bubby, what are you doing? Probably grab the things that I just remembered later in the week. But yeah, at least for now I've got something. At least I have my kitchen drawer back. <laughs> okay, grateful. Oh, organizers. I need those, because this drawer is just gonna be a crap shoot. If I don't repurchase those. Fun times. Tell me you've been rolling in the dirt without telling me. You've been rolling in the dirt, you look gray. Oh my gosh, Bubby, you're so dirty. <laughs> Hold on, bub. There you go, pup. I don't know if you guys can tell just how nasty this dog is, but he's a different shade. He's like just gray because of how much dirt he has on him. So I gotta try to get this out before he gets in my car. If you know Blue, he loves rolling in dirt. He loves rolling in dirt roads. Like, literally anything that's just as dirty as possible, Blue loves to roll on, so. I mean, it is what it is, you know? <laughs> hey, this isn't playtime. This is serious get dirt off you before you get in my car time. This, like, really isn't even helping. Dang, Blue. You are the dirt king, child. Come here. No, no, no. Good boy. Yeah, we like shaking off dirt. Come here. Come. No. Drop. 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 Hey. Get a grip. Come here. Sit. I have to mother you sometimes. You know, listen. Yeah. Just like a little toddler avoiding bedtime. No. Stop it. Bubby, I'm not trying to play with you. He's like clearly brushing me as a game. That's what you mean, is you want to play. <laughs> I don't know why I thought this was going to help way more than it's actually helping. Alright, break. Break, you can get up. Yeah. Just don't roll again before we have to go in the car, okay? Thank you. Good job, Bubby. You did a good job. Well, sun has set. I have yet to make dinner, so I'm gonna do that really quick. Um, and I think it's only right that we make, you know what, because it's just what's needed. So I'm gonna go ahead and get the jet boil going, heat up some water, and uh, celebrate getting new stuff for the car kitchen by having some oatmeal. I'm excited. Are you guys excited?
And Bub, go potty. Go potty. We gotta get in the car. Good boy. All right, help up. Good boy. <laughs> no. It's my oatmeal. I have to give Blue his uh, bone for the night so he'll leave me alone while I eat my food. Otherwise, he's going to be a menace. I put it over here. Can I do this one handed? Ow. Oh, crap. Hold on, hold on. Wait. Wait. No, no, no. Get it back. You know the drill, kid. We do this every single night. There you go. Good boy. All right, Blue's happy and I'm happy. Oatmeal for dinner! Nothing is better. You guys, I love oatmeal. There's nothing better than oatmeal. When I go through my protein oats phase, it's bad. I'm a menace for for protein oats. You guys know what is so funny? <laughs> I've been dying laughing about this since I saw it, but in my previous video where I talked about all of my stuff getting stolen, someone commented on it and was like, oh, like, this is a scam, you know? Like, don't you guys know she's scamming you? Like, this isn't real. <laughs> and one of my subscribers responded back and was like, don't you think if it was a scam, she would have told us that all of her expensive stuff was stolen, not, like, her oatmeal? Like, she's not scamming us for her oatmeal. <laughs> it's like, that is the funniest thing I've ever heard. Can you imagine me running a scam for oatmeal? <laughs> oh, man, that is so funny. She's scamming you for more oatmeal. <laughs> I do love oatmeal. I know that. I gotta remember to turn off these overhead lights. Sometimes I forget and then I'll be up here doing something like editing or whatever. And sometimes I'll run my car throughout the night just to charge like my power station or run AC for blue or whatever. And then I'm almost running my battery dry because I'm leaving my overhead lights on and charging my electronics. And I go to turn Rue over and he's like... Mm. <laughs> Good job, Maria. You're almost stranding yourself. I posted my video today about um, all of my stuff getting stolen, and so I've been talking to you guys in the comments about it. And I just wanna, I just wanna take a moment to say thank you to everybody for being so supportive. Like, honestly, it made me kind of emotional, which is hard to do. Um, I'm not very emotional, but I was just really, really blown away by how amazing and how much you guys cared and just like how sweet you were whether you just left a comment or were reassuring or had been through that experience before in some capacity and you were just giving me advice I just I want to say thank you guys so much it really means the world to me and everybody that sent money I don't even know like thank you thank you thank you thank you thank you times a million Please don't ever feel like you have to do that. I know that you guys want to support and want to help, and I appreciate that more than you'll ever know. Like, I don't have the capacity or the words to be able to convey how thankful I am for that. But to the people that still went out of their way and sent money or joined the memberships to support or did something, I'm just like at a loss for words. I feel like I really have a family behind me, as like corny as that probably sounds. And I just want you guys to know that like I couldn't do this alone. Like this channel, is really like a big family and I, I feel like I really felt that today talking to you guys and just thank you guys so much for caring, commenting, supporting in any capacity that you can. Just I wanted to just say thank you. Me and Blue appreciate it so much and thank you for being so sweet. I don't know what else to say besides we're just like I feel like guilty 
and maybe that's just because of how I was raised, but I don't, like, don't know how to handle it when somebody gives me money or is just like, here, I just wanted to support, I just wanted to help. I'm like, oh my gosh, what do I owe you? I, now I'm in debt to you, what, what, what do I do? Like, <laughs> I know that's a me issue, but like, I, I don't know, I just, I guess I just don't ever want it to come across wrong or you guys to think that, you know, you have to do anything. Like, you guys just watching my videos and supporting and being nice and caring about Blue and I is more than I could ever thank you guys for. So, so especially for everybody that went above and beyond that, I'm just like flabbergasted. <laughs> so. Okay, before I start crying or get even more cheesy, I'll leave it at that. And Blue is sleeping, but he's also very thankful. Working. Hey, sports. I heard someone got engaged. Yeah. You dog. Ah, ow. <laughs> oh, no. mm -hmm. I'm being sabotaged. Of I'm going to find a person <laughs> and punish them. Absolutely. Or you could just be nice to your customers. You're an idiot. There's the joke. <laughs> Dwight is like one of my favorite TV characters of all time. If you watch The Office, you'd know. I'm gonna let this play and get some sleep. Blue's currently chewing a bone and living his best life. Aren't you, bub? <laughs> All right, we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.